right, so Virgo, we're going to have a look at what's going to come up for you. And now keep in mind that this will not resonate for every Virgo. If you like a personal reading, I'll leave that description down below. Another thing is we also have um, these protection bags, spiritual protection bags. Okay, so if you're interested in things like this, we also have gems and crystals and all that other stuff will be in the description down below as well, Virgo. Okay, so let's shuffle. Have a look at your current situation and then some messages and advice for you. Virgo, what is going on? going on with you. You're going to be noticing a lot of, like, things happening, but it's very unex- like... It's, it's very unexplained how they happen. You know what I said? It's like kind of like a magical thing. Like, things that don't make sense are going to start happening. It's like, what? You know? You've got a lot of spirits around you, a lot of different ones. There's one in particular that has a hold of you, that is protecting you, that is not going to let you go. So, this is Virgo's current situation as of right now. It's like there was someone who made you unhappy in your life. I see that you kind of like cut ties with that and you kind of question, was that a good thing to do or was it, you know? Um, they kind of did these things intentional towards you, Virgo, however. It's kind of like a low vibe. Like they didn't really care how they made you feel. They just kind of did things. It was kind of like a selfish energy that you're dealing with. Spilling the deck, we have the Five of Swords. With the Seven of Swords. Four of Cups. We have the uh, the Lovers. This is Gemini energy. We have the World. Ten of Cups. Six of Pentacles. The moon, which can be seen as cancer energy. The wheel of fortune. Three of cups. We have the eight of cups. Page of wands. Uh, five of wands. We have the Observer of the Knight of Wands. So, Virgo, yeah. We have Spirit here sending you a lot of tests with that Five of Wands. Okay. I see a relationship coming up for you if you're a single Virgo. It can be with a Gemini or a Cancer, Pisces, someone with those placements. Um, if you're already with someone, you know you're just sticking with that person, but I see a really good relationship coming up for you. Lovers, Ten of Cups, Wheel of Fortune, I see you being really happy in your life. Like, what you've been asking for from Spirit is coming to you, you understand? What you've been asking for, you are getting, Virgo. I see that one person that you ended ties with, that sort of manipulative, selfish person, still trying to, like, plot against you. 
but like I said, you are protected here, so what they do won't really affect you that much. Like I see them thinking about you. Okay, but they're it's like they, they come up they're coming up with this this plan of how to do things that aren't good to you, Virgo. I forgot deck. that over there, but, yeah, so, better off ignoring that person, but new beginnings here, Virgo, okay, your life improving, what you've been asking for is coming into your life, I see love coming into your life as well, um, I see you're speaking to a lot of people about this as well, so let's see some messages and advice for you. to love. Relationships, passion, fulfillment. Once again, we're talking about <laughs> love and relationships here in Virgo. Being open to that. Teach and share, instill, instruct, educate. Okay, so Virgo, what you learn here, okay, what you learn here spiritually and through your life, you're going to end up teaching others about that as well. Okay, like share your knowledge to other people. Remember who you are, culture, resilience, beliefs. So really remember who you are, Virgo. Okay? Exactly who you are. Have the high priest intend and create guardian angel you are not alone white witch be the light water guardian connect with your emotions so virgo all this stuff here like i said you have a lot of spirits around you trying to protect you guardian angel and water guardian you have a lot of guardians around you um a couple things here I think that is because you're moving into that high priest or high priestess energy. Some of you might even be like a, a white witch, or maybe you have a white witch around you. Someone who does those type of things. Either way. You know. You just know. You have Spirit of Air. So let's have a look at this card. Clarity and expansive perceptive perception of life is emerging. You're being advised to see life from a higher perspective. Clear out mental clutter. Breathe. All is well. Do not be concerned. The cowwebs are being cleared away. Communication. Communicate your truth. Take care of details, pay attention, and don't let things slip through the cracks. Take time to hear the truth of others. Spirit is whispering to you. Open your mind to see a situation in a new light. Okay? Number 27, the measurable power of the heart. Wait, so Virgo, this is like really going towards where your heart is calling you. Okay, what feels right to you? Not what your mind is saying, but what your heart is saying. It's direction. Okay, so Virgo, that is all I have for you. Let me know if that resonates. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more content, don't forget to like, subscribe. Bye, guys.